My name is Hai Hui Wang. Uh, I'm Chinese and uh, I moved to New Zealand in 1998 with my family. So now I'm living in Auckland. Uh, so I've been living in New Zealand for almost 20 years. My job is um, full-time painter. Yeah, I've been doing art for for a long, long time since I was a child. Yeah, I've been a painter uh, for many years. Um, I'm interested in art since I was a little child. Um, when I was in China. Uh, I finished my Chinese painting bachelor degree in Nanjing Art University and uh, since I moved to New Zealand I'm starting uh, um, exploring um, Western art so now um, my major is in oil painting my, I'm using just like my language when I was in China I speak in Mandarin but when I was in New I'm in New Zealand I'm speaking English. Now in art, I'm using a uh, uh, Western art medium like uh, oil painting and acrylic watercolor, this kind of uh, material. And um, uh, I did uh, lots of portraiture when I was at school. And uh, because um, at that time I'm thinking, uh, um, considering my cultural background and my Chinese identity because when um, first when I moved to New Zealand I met when I met some new friends every new friend asked me where I come from and uh, that's a question I also ask myself uh, who am I and uh, where I come from and uh, uh, where I'm going so um, in my old painting a family tree painting I'm um, doc, uh, documentary my family members, every my family members, and all my um, uh, like um, you know uh, my grandparents' generation, uh, parents' generation, sibling generation, and also my um, the new generation, new Chinese generation, who were born in New Zealand, and uh, uh, that's um, just like a tree. The, uh, the the root of the tree in China, like my grandparents, as uh, a new branch was growing up in um, in New Zealand. It's um, it's documentary um, a family shifting, and the family um, like a family um, uh, development. Um, now and. Uh, um, I try to reflect that situation in my art as a as a Chinese immigrant living in New Zealand. So um, I did. Um, um, I try to explore um, where my family come from, and we obviously we come from China. At that time, my uh, grandma still living in China. Uh, all her life, never been other countries. All her life uh, living in China, and uh, her life is amazing because uh, he was born in um, end of the nineteenth century. Most of his, uh, her life living in twentieth century, and uh, she passed away at the beginning of the twenty first century. So her life across three centuries, yeah. she experienced. Um, uh, all the Chai, you know, uh, the contemporary China's movements, like, um, you know, from old, old times, and um, most of her time living in New China, mm. in communist Chinese society, yeah, and her life uh, experienced a big change from old time to the new times, and also um, the, my parents. Um, Move uh, uh, when they retired, they moved to uh, New Zealand, and my s and my si I only got one old sister, so now uh, all my family is living in New Zealand, and uh, I've been 
So I try to um, documentary um, the family shifting in my family tree paintings. When I back to China only occasionally, but uh, I feel sometimes I feel like um, uh, uncomfortable, you know, because I feel a hard hard to fit in um, in Chinese in, in, in Chinese community in China. I I I I seem got nothing in common with him, you know, and so. Uh, uh, but when I was in New Zealand, um, when I'm in New Zealand, I found that, you know, also hard fit in the mainstream of Kiwi community. In my painting, I try to um, uh, achieve um, this kind of um, uh, loneliness, emptiness in my painting, which I feel um, connect with this landscape, um, with the New Zealand landscape. And I also want to um, um, give uh, give some new things in my painting, which um, because I'm uh, Chinese, I'm looking at the things uh, from a Chinese angle, point of view. Um, so I try to um, put my identity and uh, my try to um, give my uh, culture background. Um, uh, influence in my paintings. I'm a, I'm a painter, I'm an artist, so um, I love the uh, beautiful stuff. Um, because I've been living in New Zealand, I feel like uh, um, in my blood I'm still Chinese. So I like collecting uh, Chinese antique stuff, and um, especially old stuff. Um, when I, uh, because uh, you can, you can tear from the antique items. You can see what's the uh, um, uh, what's a craftsman's thinking, and uh, what's their idea. Why they making these kind of things? Um, what's the concept and the idea behind the things. So uh, as an artist, uh, I'm doing the similar process. Um, and also, um, because I'm living in New Zealand, and I feel like uh, I try to make myself uh, my home, like uh, all surrounded by Chinese items. Uh, of course, I'm also uh, got some Pacific uh, uh, artifact. Uh, um, but the many Chinese uh, antique and uh, Chinese items, furniture uh, and ornament, uh, ornaments, um, because uh, uh, I'm wondering if I'm if I'm still living in uh, China, maybe my um, my house house interior design may be completely different style, maybe uh, Western or European style, but uh, um, now I'm living in like a, a, a Western European community. I try to make my own home like a, like still living in China. <laughs> so.